Today is Saturday, March 11th, 2023, in the year of our Lord. 2023 March blessings, everyone. Welcome to Now is the Time for Discernment with Prophetess Seneth Brown, the founder and host pastor of the New Testament Church of Christ, the Redeemer of Canada, a place where dreams are realized and destinies are fulfilled. Bless the name of the Lord. If you have not yet subscribed to Redeemer of Canada, please do so now. And don't forget to click on the icon for notifications notifications. Before I give you now is the time for discernment, please turn your Bibles with me to Romans 8 verses 30 to 39. Romans 8 verses 30 to 39. And it reads, moreover, whom he did predestinate them he also called, and whom he called them he also justified, and whom he justified them he also glorified. What shall we then say to these things? If God be for us, who can be against us? He that spare not is own son, but delivered him up for us all. How shall he not with him also freely give us all things? Who shall lay anything to the charge of God's elect? It is God that justifieth. Who is he that condemneth? It is Christ that died, yea, rather, that is risen again, who is even at the right hand of God, who also make it intercession for us, who shall separate us from the love of Christ, shall tribulation or distress or persecution or famine or nakedness or apparel or sword as it is written for thy sake we are killed all the day long we are accounted a sheep for the slaughter nay in all these things we are more than conquerors through Jesus that loves us for I am persuaded that neither death nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, neither heights or depth, nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. And I honor the powerful, relevant, unadulterated gospel of Jesus Christ. The word is undiluted. I honor it by saying glory be to the Father, glory be to the Son, glory be to the Holy Ghost as it was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be, it is world without end. Amen, 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 and amen. Now is the time for discernment and it is March 2023. Bless the name of the Lord. Here are a few divine words for you in March 2023 and beyond. Hope, faith, glory, sanctification, justification, glorification, dedication. The word enough, good, more than the usual. Bethlehem, Israel, Jerusalem, open wide. Other words, mouth, condemnation separation, declarations, confirmations, declaring and decreeing, utterances, precision, accuracy, march forward, disarray, reflection, marriage. Bless the name of the Lord. Those are some of the words that you will hear in March 20. 23 and beyond. A few divine numbers for March 2023 20, and beyond. Bless the name of the Lord. 3, 4, 11, 12, 15, 16, 17, 18, 
21, 25, 31, 32, 33, 40, 46, 48, 58, 61, 67, 68, 70, 80, 9, 87, 98, 90, 102, 103, 145, and 146. God bless you all. Bless the name of the Lord. Here are some pivotal scriptures to pay very close attention to for March 2023 and beyond the book of Psalms. Hallelujah. Also read today and see for yourselves Psalm 68 and Psalms 87. The book of Isaiah. Uh, yes, you can read today Isaiah 4, Isaiah 11 and 18. Uh, yes, the book of Ezekiel. You can read today Ezekiel chapters 33 all the way to 40. God bless you for those pivotal scriptures that you will read and empower your lives with. It is March 2023. What is heaven forecast declaring to his people and the world? Ah, uh, yes, I heard in my spirit that Jesus is the internal cleanser of his people and uh, on humanity, both physically and spiritually. Glory to God Almighty. I heard in my spirit that Jesus is the interceptor of good and bad things that will happen in our world. Yes, I heard in my spirit that this is the month of the mouth. Yes, you heard me this. March 2023 is the month and season of the mouth. Yes, our mouth Oh, yes, will be made open wide, hallelujah, and declare a thing and decree the word of God and it shall come to pass. I heard in my spirit that this is the month of the mouth and the mouth will declare and decree a thing and it shall surely manifest. Glory to God. I heard in my spirit, March is the month of the mouth. Out of your mouth. Oh, shall flow declarations from the throne room. Ah, uh, yes, and the Holy Ghost shall give us utterances. Oh, greater utterances to declare in the earth. Oh, glory to God Almighty. This is March 2023, and this is the year of the mouth. Our mouth, oh, shall be open wide, and shall open wide, and declare a thing, and it shall manifest. We shall decree a thing and it shall be established. Oh, glory to God Almighty. The book of Job will also be a pivotal oh, book for us in this month. Oh, yes, of March 2023 and beyond. Oh, glory to God Almighty. I heard in my spirit that God has given us power and authority to declare and decree over strongholds holding back our world. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Almighty, I heard in my spirit, people of God, that is in God's general army. It is time to declare and decree over strongholds in families, houses, or schools, or neighborhoods, communities, workplaces, or parliaments, or governmental bodies, or yes, political arenas, or palaces and society. Oh, glory to God, it's time. This is the month of the mouth and our mouth is going to open wide and we shall decree a thing and it shall be established. Oh glory to God. I heard in my spirit people of God that are in God's general army. Now is the perfect time to declare the Holy Ghost prophetic words from the throne of grace over the king of king or oh, kingdom and break strongholds over Luciferian kingdom. Oh yes, it is now, is the month, March 2023, is the month to decree a thing and it shall be established. This is the month of the mouth. Oh God Almighty, our mouths are going to open wide and we are going to decree. Oh, thus saith the Lord thy God. Hallelujah. Glory to God Almighty. Oh, glory to God just the same way as it was in the day of prophet Samuel. Not one word fell to the ground. Likewise, God is declaring 
upon his general army and in his general army. Oh, glory to God Almighty that we ought to open wide our mouths uh, so that he will fill it up uh, with divine accuracy and precision. Uh, he will fill it up. Uh, oh, glory to God with divine mandates. Uh, oh, God Almighty and new uh, oh, manuscripts and manuals from heaven. Uh, oh, God Almighty, the floodgates are open. Uh, and as the floodgates open, uh, now open wide your mouth. Uh, hallelujah. And declare uh, all the good news of Jesus Christ. Uh, declare the coming of the Messiah. Declare Yahweh is coming back again. Declare, oh glory to God, that there will be an extraordinary and usual, oh praise coming out of Ethiopia. Oh glory to God Almighty, Ethiopia shall see a greater praise, a greater dance, a greater worship. Oh look out for Africa. There shall be newness, oh glory to God in music. Oh, coming out of Africa, new beats coming out of Africa, new lyrics are coming out of Africa. Oh, yes, watch the hand of God. Oh, glory to God over Ethiopia. Oh, glory to God Almighty. God is with you and for you. Oh, glory to God. I'm restoring Ethiopia. I'm restoring, I'm restoring, I'm restoring Africa. I'm restoring, hallelujah, Ethiopia. I'm restoring. Oh, glory to God Almighty. This is the month, uh, oh yes, of the mouth. Uh, and I open wide my mouth. Uh, and I declare uh, and decree right now uh, that we are going to, oh yes, experience and see with our eyes and hear with our ears. Uh, oh, God Almighty. And unusual happenings and discoveries in Egypt. Uh, oh yes, Egypt is on God's radar. It's Ethiopia is on God's radar. Africa, Asia, you are on God's radar. Oh, watch world, because God is about to, oh, silence, oh, God Almighty, the, the noises of the enemy. Oh, God Almighty, God is getting ready. Oh, God, the silence, oh, the noise of Luciferian and Luciferian kingdom. Oh, glory to God. Only one noise, oh, God Almighty, will be be established and that is the noise oh sing aloud oh God with joyful noise unto the Lord oh come let us sing a new song unto our God because he is worthy of all our praises oh Psalms 96 oh bank that in your spiritual bank account oh glory to God Psalms 95 oh come let us bow down and worship we are going going to experience out of Ethiopia. Oh, they are going to bow down and worship God as never before. They are going to do an unusual praises unto the most high God. Get ready. It is time for you, Ethiopia. Discoveries for you. An unusualness for you. Oh yes, Egypt. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Lebanon, you are on God's radar. Oh, physically and spiritually. So I will open my mouth as this is the month of the mouth. Oh yes, I will open my mouth and I'm declaring and decreeing. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Ah, that Ethiopia, oh Egypt and Lebanon are on the radar. Oh, of God Almighty, we are going to hear about them. We are going to experience things and hear about mysterious things happening, unusual occurrences, oh, spiritually and physically in those countries. Glory to God Almighty, beat, new musical beats, oh, God Almighty, new lyrics coming out of Ethiopia, new anointing, oh, shaping up to come out of Ethiopia. Oh, glory to God Almighty. The experience that Miriam had when they crossed over the Red Sea, when Moses and the children of Israel crossed over the Red Sea. Oh, glory to God, Miriam. 
Oh, she knocked the tambourine. Oh, glory to God Almighty. We are going to experience a season of Miriam. Oh, the dancing of Miriam. Oh, God Almighty is coming out of Africa. It's going to come out of Israel. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Glory to Jesus and out of the Caribbean. Oh, God Almighty, unusual dancing. Oh, God, the music. Oh, God Almighty, lyrics and songs. Oh, God, song lyrics are going to be written out of the Caribbean islands. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, the Caribbean islands are coming up with new dance beats, with new dance moves. Oh, glory to God. Watch. Oh, God is pouring out. Oh, yes, the spirit of music. Oh, God Almighty, the ministry of music is going to take wings and fly. Oh, glory to God Almighty, to the uttermost part of the earth. Oh, glory to God. But there will be a significant, oh, God Almighty, dancing, oh, God, and worship out of the Caribbean islands also. Oh, glory to God Almighty. A significant worship is coming out of Ethiopia, embrace for it, impactfulness they shall oh, shall accomplish and become and we will see the impact of what God's spirit has done through nations upon the earth oh, glory to God almighty glory to God almighty we are going to discover and we are going to see oh, glory to God that in the Middle East we shall see new oh, God almighty worship unto Hosanna we are going to see new worshippers come out oh, God of the Middle East oh, glory to God watch the Middle East because more worshippers God is raising up worshippers. God deserves to be worshipped. Our God, many shall turn oh, from Baal worship styles, my God, and from Baal worshipping, and they shall come to know the true and living God. Hallelujah. Watch out for the Middle East. Watch what the hand of the Lord shall do, because I shall do great things in the Middle East, says the Lord God. I shall do, oh, spiritually and physically, oh, Oh, my deeds and actions are oh God they are on the radar the Middle East are on my radar says the Lord God Almighty oh glory to God oh glory to Jesus oh glory 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 oh glory to God it is March 2023 oh yes and this is the month to march forward this is the month where we shall declare oh and we shall decree a thing and it shall I'll come to pass. It will manifest. It will not fall to the ground, but all of it shall come to fruition. Oh, glory to God. The word of God shall not return void because indeed we are going to bank upon the promises of the word of God as declared in Isaiah. Oh, glory to God. In Isaiah 55. In Isaiah 55. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. I heard in my spirit people of God that are in God's general army. Now is the time that the sure, potent, relevant, undiluted, and unadulterated words of God must go in through, over, and above, and within our world. It is time to spread the gospel worldwide. It is time. It is due time for the good news to spread wide abroad within the heart of humanity. Oh, glory to God. I heard in my spirit, people of God that are in God's general army. March is the month that we, oh yes, will usher in the spotlight of the holy word of God. Oh yes, the word of God will be ushered in. Oh God, as a spotlight to nations of this world. Oh, glory to God Almighty. The worldwide spreading of the good news of Jesus Christ of Nazareth is to bring salvation to the whole world.
world and continues thereafter. It is time for us to experience a billion souls harvest. Yes, a billion souls harvest is coming unto us. Oh, glory to God Almighty. I heard in my spirit people of God that are in God's general army. March is the month of the mouth. Oh, it's time to open wide your mouth and declare and decree over oh regional territorial strongholds oh yes declare and decree oh god almighty over global territorial strongholds atmospheric territorial strongholds communities, territorial strongholds, over schools, territorial strongholds, the church of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, oh, territorial strongholds, yes, nations, oh, territorial strongholds, governmental, territorial strongholds, generational, oh, yes, generational, territorial strongholds, ah, yes, God Almighty, I bless God, we shall shall and we will, oh God declare and decree, oh God over marital territorial strongholds yes the spirit of death territorial strongholds yes world leaders territorial strongholds mighty I declare and decree, oh God almighty, the kings and queens, oh princes and princesses, territorial strongholds are coming down in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth oh yes demonic territorial strongholds oh God Almighty is coming down this is the month of the mouth March is the month of the mouth open wide your mouth and declare and decree a thing and it shall come to pass oh God is saying open your mouth my people oh those that are in God's general army oh declare and decree a thing and it shall be established oh glory Glory to God Almighty. Glory, glory, glory. Oh, yes, I are the stuff Leviathan, the spirit of Leviathan territorial strongholds are coming down. The spirit of Jezebel territorial strongholds must be defeated. The spirit of Delilah territorial strongholds must be destroyed in the name of Jesus. The spirit of fornication oh territorial strongholds must be burnt up in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The spirit of adultery territorial strongholds must be buried forever. Oh glory to God God Almighty, the spirit of division, territorial strongholds, oh glory to God within families, oh within communities, oh God and within nations, oh God we speak now that they are null and void in the name of Jesus Christ our Lord, oh yes murder, oh territorial strongholds, you must come down because we shall live and not die to declare the works of the Lord we shall not die but live and declare the works of the Lord. We stand upon the promises of God's word. Oh God, Psalms 118 verse 17. Oh the blessed word of the Lord. Oh yes, the spirit of Cain. We come against the spirit of Cain. Territorial strongholds and we speak null and void in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You have done enough murdering. You have done enough killing and I speak Speak that Abel, oh God Almighty, the blood of Abel is crying out in the earth, and God has seen it, it has come to his nostrils. Ah, oh God Almighty, live, live, live. We shall live, we shall live, we shall live. Oh, we counterattack the spirit of death. We speak against the spirit of death in all nations, premature death of unborn children, of children of youths, oh God Almighty adults, oh seniors we come against the spirit of death, oh God Almighty, oh Luciferian kingdom will not have, oh God Almighty, your stalwarts your chosen veterans oh your holy nation oh your set apart people over to his kingdom because we belong to your kingdom, the kingdom of light the kingdom of power the kingdom of authority, the kingdom of God Almighty.
almighty. It's a firm kingdom. It is a sure kingdom. It is an everlasting kingdom. It is a kingdom that is unshakable. And because we serve, oh God almighty, a firm, solid, oh Christ Jesus. And on Christ Jesus, we stand firm. Oh God is foundation. Oh God almighty is firm. Oh, glory to God Almighty, his kingdom is unshakable. Oh, glory to God Almighty, his word, they change it not. Oh, God Almighty, thank you that Isaiah 40, you could go ahead and bank that into your spiritual bank account. Oh, glory to God, because dividends will be made later. Oh, glory to God Almighty, glory to God Almighty, glory. To God Almighty, you can bank this. Oh God, in your spiritual bank accounts, times four, expecting times eight. Oh God, dividends thereafter. Oh glory to God Almighty, watch what the Lord shall do. I heard in my spirit that your finances, oh glory to God, my people's finances, those that have sown four times are going to reap eight times more. Oh glory to God Almighty. And those that are sown, oh God, eight times, times eight, uh, they're going to reap 12 times, oh glory to God Almighty, and I'm going to bring completion, and I'm going to bless, oh I'm going to bless tremendously with supernatural dividends unto you my people, oh glory to God, it's time for dividends, oh glory to God, so don't be afraid, oh when you plant, don't be afraid, oh to give your first fruits, oh don't be afraid to give God. Don't be afraid to give the work of the Lord. Don't be afraid to give to the house of the Lord. Oh, glory to God, because we know, oh God, that money answer it to all things. Ah, glory to God Almighty. May God continue to bless the works of our hands, because though our hands are blessed, we are blessed in all that we touch, in all that we do. And I heard the Spirit of the Lord say, that which our hands touch it, oh God, it shall turn into gold. Oh my God, goals are going to flow, oh God Almighty, upon the things that our hands touch. Oh God, there are newness within our hands, says the Lord. Oh, I have anointed the hands of my people that are in my general army. Oh, look how people of this world, the people of God are coming up. Oh God, we will rise and we will thrive. We will rise and we are going to survive. We will rise and we are going to manifest. We will rise and we are not going backward, but we are going forward fearlessly. We will rise and declare the unadulterated gospel of Jesus Christ. This is the month of March, oh, 2023. Oh, march on with your mouth wide open. March on with your mouth wide open, declare in good news, encourage the people of God, oh out of your mouth, oh God Almighty is going to flow, oh words from the throne of grace, oh God Almighty, God has given us access, oh people of God, and people that are in God's general army, oh God has allowed us even now, oh free access to the courts of heaven, oh glory to God Almighty, it is time Oh, to seek. Oh, yes, it's time to seek. It is time to hear. It is time, oh God, to speak. Oh God, that which God is declaring, that which the Holy Ghost is uttering unto God's chosen people. Speak. Let no one silence you. Let no one quiet you. Let no one undermine you. Let no one stand in the way of you hearing God for yourselves. Oh, glory to God Almighty. And so even now, oh God Almighty, it's right now in the name of Jesus Christ, the spirit of bombers and bombing worldwide territorial strongholds over the mind of carnality and wickedness and evil in the mind of humanity, the hearts of humanity, or the souls of humanity, the minds of humanity. Demons and devils, territorial strongholds must come down as we fast times four, and then we level up again 
times four. So we're going to fast times four, times four. Hallelujah. Glory to God Almighty in the name of Jesus. And God is declaring unto his people in his general army that we are going to see results for our prayers and fasting. We're going to see results. God said this is a season also. This is the month. March is the month of answered prayers. March is the month of the mouth. Ah, decree a thing and it shall be established. Yes, God. And it's also the month that we are going to receive tangible, oh God Almighty, answers to our many prayers. Our prayers are answered. Oh God, we serve a prayer answer, God. We serve a God that hears. We serve a God that cares. We serve a God who is touched. Oh God Almighty Son is touched with the feelings of our infirmities. We serve a God that will not back down from hearing the cry of his people. This poor man cried and the Lord heard him and delivered him out of all his fear. Remember I said a pivotal oh, book for us in this month of March and beyond three and beyond in his arms. Oh God Almighty is going to have great effect upon nations, upon this world, upon the kingdom of light, upon the kingdom of God Almighty. Glory to God, your prayers all will be answered. Oh, it's on the way. Answers are on the way, says God. I make in haste. Oh, speedy, speedily will I answer you, my people. Speedily will I answer you. Oh, God Almighty, even as I'm speaking right now, I heard the Spirit of the Lord said, our answers are on its way. Oh, to my people. Oh, God Almighty, that I've prayed. Some of you gave up on even your prayers, but God is saying, no, I have heard you and I've answered you and the solutions are on their way. Oh, God Almighty, answers are coming to locate your doors. Answers are coming to your workplaces. Answers are coming to show up in your bank account, says the Lord. You shall see miracle monies into your bank account, says the Lord God, because I have sent solutions, money solutions, where they are financial defeat, where there has been financial woes. God said, you will say, wow, oh, glory. Glory to God. This is the month of March 2023. It is the month of wow. God is about to wow us with the Almighty by answering our prayers. God is about to wow his people by the solutions that he's sending to our doors. Oh God, in our homes. God, in our cities. In our neighborhoods. God, in our society. God Almighty. God, God, God. You're about to wow Oh God Almighty, we brace for the impact of wow. You are about to wow the church. You're about to wow your kingdom. Oh glory to God. Watch God in this month and beyond. Glory to God. March is the mouth because I am going to partnership. I'm going to partner, says God, with the mouth of my people in this month of the mouth. I am going to partner with my people's mouths. My God, our mouths are going to partner with God. And when we partner with his, he said, I have no choice but to answer and send back solutions to earth and send back solution to my king and stand by manifestation. Oh, glory to God Almighty, because uh, this is the month of the mouth uh, and whatever we declare and decree, it shall be established. God has declared even now upon the heavens and in the earth uh, that he has uh, and will manifest uh, all the words that comes out uh, of the mouth of his people. Oh, people of God, open your mouth wide and declare a thing and watch it come to pass. Oh, believe in the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, that which he has spoken to you, it shall manifest. That which he has spoken to you will not tarry. That which he has declared over you, over your children's lives, oh, glory to God Almighty, over your household, it's coming to fruition. Oh, don't give up because the Almighty is partnering with our mouths in this season. Glory to God Almighty.
Almighty, starting in this month of March, ah, because it's the month of the mouth. Open wide your mouth. Open wide your mouth. Hallelujah. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord of the earth. Open wide your mouth and make a joyful adoration unto him who alone is worthy above principalities and powers, above the rulers of darknesses, above the plans of the adversaries. Oh God Almighty, we boomerangs back every assignment. Oh God Almighty, to the lake face of hell. Oh glory to God Almighty. This is March 2023. Glory to God. This is a month of wow. God is about to wow, 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 wow you. Ah, wow, wow, wow. God is about to W-O-W you. Hallelujah. Watch the hand of the Lord. Ah, those prayers that you prayed over your children long ago. Ah, watch me send solutions. Watch me change and transform your child, your children, or your grandchild, your grandchildren. Watch me, oh, change bring change. Sudden changes are coming to your children, coming to your children's children, coming to your grandchildren, your grand-grandchildren. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, sudden changes are coming to your marriage. Oh, sudden changes are coming to your households. Sudden changes are coming to communities. Oh, sudden changes are coming to the churches. My God, the universal church of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Oh, this is the month of the wow, the wow, the wow, the wow. Oh, God Almighty, God Almighty. This is also the month of the why. Why, why, why? Oh, glory to God. W-H-Y. Why, 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 why? Because you prayed. Because we prayed. Oh, God, many times over. And God said, this is why I'm answering you. I'm answering my people's cries. I'm answering the heart cry from my people. I have heard their prayers. I have seen their afflictions and I've come now to bring solutions in this month of March 2023 and be a month of solutions. Answered prayers, my God. <laughs> yes, fasting being heard and appreciated. Glory to God, your prayer and fasting has not gone unnoted by God. He said, watch me, I shall do a swift move in bringing about positive changes in my people's lives. In all aspects of your lives, God is doing a sudden shift in positivity, oh God Almighty, in your finances, in your spiritual, in your economical, yes, Spiritually, there will be a sudden shifting of positiveness. Spiritually, physically, emotionally, relationally, maritally, atmospherically, territorially, God Almighty, so economically, psychologically, mentally, sexually, we shall experience, a, hallelujah, a sudden shift. God Almighty, positivity upon our lives, upon our homes, upon our families, upon our neighbors, my God, our community and our society. Glory to God Almighty. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Canada is about to see a sudden shift, diabolical shift in the economy. Oh, God Almighty, Canada is about to see, oh yes, the hand of God do a sudden shift. Oh, glory to the most thy God, economically, oh, spiritually, and physically. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, yes, even in time of famine, oh, Canada will still have growth. Oh, God Almighty, the, the Bank of Canada will see an increased growth. Hallelujah. An increased growth, regardless of what is happening around the world. The nation of Canada is a blessed nation. Canada has stand upon this nation, declaring that God is bringing Canada. Oh, yes, a sudden shift of positivity. There will be, oh, yes, some unusual occurrences. Oh, glory to God. Unexpected changes.
riches are also coming. Oh, calamities to Canada. Nevertheless, God is giving Canada expansions, expansion, economical expansions. Canada, you will see, oh God Almighty, financial expansion, economical, over, 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 overflowing. Oh God Almighty, blessings. Oh Canada, oh glory to God. God is standing by you and for you. Oh Canada, oh God is, oh yes, your deliverer. Oh Canada, God is your protector. Canada, oh God loves you. Oh the nation of Canada, brace for the impact of God's great revival. There will be, oh like a tsunami, revivals are coming to Canada. The nation of Canada, many, oh yes, in prominent positions, oh yes, leaders and leaderships shall awaken unto the supernatural move of the power of the Lord. Oh, Canada. Oh, yes, you are on God's radar. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Canada, you are on God's radar. Oh, yes, for a touchdown. Oh, God is touching down on Canada. Oh, God Almighty, brace ourselves. We ought to brace ourselves. Oh, for the impact of revivals. We shall brace ourselves for the impact of awakening. Oh, Canada, the hand of God is mightily upon you as a nation. Oh, glory to God Almighty. I declare and decree, oh, supernatural wisdom over our prime minister. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, prime minister, oh, Justin Trudeau, Lord God, and all the leaders, and all the mayors, and all the premiers, oh, glory Glory to God, the counselors, all oh, the senators, may God oh, touch all of you. May God cover and protect all of you. Oh, may God grant you all as leaders of this great nation of Canada, oh, supernatural wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. Oh, yes, to take this country to another level, another level. This country is going to be known, oh God, more so than ever before. This country is going to be expanded, oh, more so than ever before. This country will become a country that will be talked about, oh, like never before in the history of Canada. Oh, Canada, oh, God loves you. Oh, Canada, God is defender. Oh, Canada, God is the defender of you. Oh, Canada, oh, God is going to see you through. Oh, Canada, what a country of greatness, opportunities. Oh, God Almighty. Oh, yes, God. Promotion is coming to Canada because God is going to promote his leaders, those in prominent positions, and those that are going into new positions will be heightened and will be advanced, will be expanded, and will be promoted, says the Lord of hosts. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, glory to God. The Bank of Canada shall increase. I stand 
Oh, I stand. Oh, I stand, says the Lord your God. Oh, defending Canada, I stand. Oh, Canada, I stand. Oh, God, great. We shall see and experience and hear of some great rabbis shall come out of Canada. Some great teachers, hallelujah, shall come out of Canada. Some great musicians shall come out of Canada. Canada is going to be known greater on the world map. Oh, hallelujah, the season to promote Canada is now. And now is the season that God is going to promote Canada. Oh, Canada, fear thou not. The Lord thy God is with thee. Oh, Richter God. This is March 2023, the year of prosperity, the year of victory, where victory is assured to the church. Oh, God Almighty, thank you. Hallelujah. It is March 2023. I heard in my spirit, people of God, that is in God's general army. March is the month to suit up in God's whole armor gears for a spiritual, a great spiritual warfare. Let me repeat this unto you. Mighty my spirit, people of God that are in God's general army, March is the month to suit up in God's old armor gears for a great spiritual warfare. Yes, see and read Ephesians chapter 6, verses 10 through 18. Go ahead and bank Ephesians 6 and the book of Ephesians in your spiritual bank account. And we say amen, 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 and amen. Bless the name of the Lord. Church of Jesus Christ, people of God, it's time to armor up. It is time to suit up, dress up, and spirit up. You heard me. People of the Most High God. Ah, yes, people that belong to the kingdom of the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. It is time to armor up or to suit up, to dress up and spirit up in the fullness of Christ Jesus. Amen and amen. It is time for an action pack full of gospel gears to empower us and fight opposition for us. I heard in my spirit people of God that are in God's general army. It's time to position your mouth. Oh God Almighty in the direction of hell and declare and decree. Oh God Almighty God's unstoppable, undeniable words over territorial devils and demons in our world today. Oh, now is the time to encapsulate. Oh, yes, the transforming word of God in our hearts, in our souls, in our minds, in our spirits. My God, now is the time to encapsulate. Oh, yes, the transforming word of God in our hearts, in our souls, in our minds, in our spirit. Glory to God Almighty. Glory, glory. Now is the time to declare and decree God's defensive words over your life, over your families, over your children and over your children's children's lives. Lord God, we, oh God, send back every assignment, oh God, to the abyss of hell. Those that oppose our children, oh God Almighty, shall not win because you are backing us up, oh God, with your powerful word. Oh God, Psalms again, Psalms 35, oh God Almighty, Psalms 6. Oh God will defend his people. Oh glory to God Almighty. Psalms 34 verse 19. Oh go ahead and back this in your spiritual bank.
bank account. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord, oh yes, he will deliver us out of them all. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Oh, Psalm 27 verse 1. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? He is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Oh, yes, when the wicked, even our enemies come up against us, oh, to eat up our flesh, they too shall stumble and they shall fall. And don't worry, when war shall rise against us, in this will we be confident. One thing we will desire of the Lord, that we will seek after, that we may dwell in the house of the Lord forever, 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 O oh God. Because thou hast anointed our heads with oil, and our cup overflow. O oh, surely goodness and mercy shall be with us all the days of our lives. O oh God Almighty, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Oh, not just a day, not just one hour, oh God Almighty, but all the days of our lives, all the days, as long as we are alive on planet Earth, oh glory to God, we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever, glory to God. It is March 2023, and I my spirit, people of God that are in God's general army, it's time to open wide your mouths and prophesy over the wickedness of sex trafficking of our innocent children, our innocent youths, our boys and our girls in this world. It is time to prophesy, oh glory to God, against the wickedness of humanity's heart. It is time, oh, to renounce them, oh glory to God Almighty, so that our children will live in freedom and liberty, oh, and not being abused. Glory, the hands of the adversary must be broken in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth over our children, over our young boys and girls in the mighty name of Jesus Christ our Lord. Ah, God Almighty, our children and youths will live in freedom and fulfill their God-given purposes and destinies. Yes, our young boys and girls, our children and our youths will live in freedom and liberty in our world and fulfill their purposes purposes and destinies in God. Ah, uh, who the Son of Man said free, they are free indeed. God is bringing about liberty greatest in this season, in this month and beyond, March 2023 and beyond. Liberty to you, God's people. Liberty to the world. Liberty to all nations of this world. The liberty that only comes through Jesus Christ our Lord. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth on him would not perish but have everlasting life. God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world but that the world through him might be saved. And that is found in St. John 3 um, verse 16 and 17. Glory to God. Go ahead and back the book of John into your spiritual bank accounts in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen, amen and amen. Bless the Lord. It is March 2023. Yes, I prophesy against satanic entrapments against our babies, our children, and youths in our world. I prophesy against satanic entrapments against our babies, our children, and youths in our world. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, these strongholds must come down in the powerful, righteous, holy name of the Lord, ah, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh, yes, the enemy is trying hard to destroy our future, which is our youth. But we come against them in the name of Jesus. We come against the adversaries from all aspects, from all dimensions. We speak to the four corners, oh God Almighty, that our 
are holding satanic entrapments for our children, for our babies, for our youths. And we say you must be null and void in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. We boomerangs back all the plans of hell right back to the abyss of hell in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I prophesy, oh, globally that our babies, children, and youths will not be entrapped by the schemes of Satan, but be delivered in Jesus' victorious name. It's March 2023. Yes, I heard in my spirit, people of God that are in God's general army, prophesy that our young girls and boys will not become victims of molestation, rape, and incest. We prophesy over the lives of our young girls and young boys worldwide that they will not become victims of molestation, rape, and incest, and even whatever else the schemes of the devil have against them. It is null and void in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. In Jesus' powerful name, I prophesy over our children and youths. Yes, yes, that they will live out their priceless worth and victoriously their destinies. Glory to the Most High God. I prophesy over our children and youths that they will live out their priceless worth and victoriously their destinies. I heard in my spirit that March is the month of the mouth. Open wide your mouth, then believe what you have declared and decree. Oh, glory to God, and you will achieve and manifest in Jesus Christ. Christ's radiant name. I heard in my spirit that God's radar is significantly upon, oh, Lebanon, oh, yes, Israel, oh, Syria, Africa, Asia, the Caribbean Islands, Canada, the USA, oh, glory to God, our European countries, oh, glory to God, and the West Indies, both spiritually and physically. God will do so something swiftly, something new, something to be discovered, oh glory to God, and something that's going to marvel our eyes, oh God of Israel, oh watch out Sidon, oh and Ethiopia, oh watch out, oh glory to God, because out of Ethiopia shall come the greatest of all praise and worship that the world has never seen before, that will transform the world map, oh glory to God Almighty, ah uh, the world will behold a significant wave of God's glory, of glorious worship out of Ethiopia. Oh, God's hands are upon you, Ethiopia. Oh, God's hands are upon you, and you will see economical changes. I heard in my spirit, ah, uh, yes, uh, that we will see the cross of Jesus Christ of Nazareth appear in various and huge places in all nations. We are going to see the cross of Jesus Christ of Nazareth in temples that never believe in the cross before. We are going to see the cross. Oh, it's going to show up. Oh, God Almighty, in theaters that have never accepted it before. It's going to show up in waters. Oh, God, bodies of waters. Oh, God Almighty, it's going to show up. Oh, yes, and I, S K Y. Oh, God Almighty, to the sky. Oh God, I see transparency. I see transformation. Oh God Almighty, in the cross, in the symbol of the cross, in the moon. Watch out for the moon. There is going to be changes in the moon. There will be changes in the moon. Watch out. Oh, for God's manifestation. Oh God Almighty, because the cross of Jesus Christ. Oh yes, the physical symbolic of the cross of Jesus 
Jesus Christ of Nazareth is going to make known to all nations. And so it's going to show up in places, unusual places, that you never expect to see the cross. Oh, God Almighty, be shown and seen. It's going to show up more even in movies. Oh, glory to God Almighty. Cinemas are going to show it more and more. Oh, the cross of Jesus Christ. Expect to see the cross of Jesus Christ of Nazareth should show up ah, in very unusual places in all nations of this world. I heard in my spirit that March is the month to stop, observe, and reflect. This is the month to stop, observe, and reflect. Now is the time to open your eyes wide to the various daily changing occurrences in our world and pray and fast accordingly. Now is the time to open your eyes wide to the various daily changing occurrences in our world and pray and fast accordingly. March 2023 and beyond is the season of great reflection. This year will have significant reflections of goodness and even calamities and crises. Many things needed for your future will be revealed for you to move surely forward. Many things needed for your future will be revealed for you to move surely forward. It's time to set sail on fasting and prayer. We need to put prayer and fasting into action now more than ever before. We need to put prayer and fasting into action now more than before. I heard in my spirit that the Holy Spirit will anoint 70 anointed elders and deploy them in his righteous kingdom globally. Ah, yes, I heard in my spirit uh, that the Holy Spirit uh, will anoint 70 appointed elders uh, and deploy them in his righteous uh, kingdom globally. See and read Numbers uh, chapter 11 uh, verses 16 through 25. Uh, go ahead and back Numbers uh, 11 and number 6 and also back the entire book of numbers bless the name of the Lord it's March it is March 2023 and I heard in my spirit that we will see changes in bodies of water worldwide such as the seas the oceans the lakes and the rivers we're gonna see significant changes in the bodies of water worldwide hallelujah it is March and I heard Heard in my spirit that St. Luke 4 verses 18 to 19 will resonate in the earth greater than before. Let us read it together. Oh, St. Luke 4 verses 18 and 19 puts it this way. The spirit of the Lord is upon me because he hath anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He hath sent me to heal the brokenhearted to preach deliverance to the captives and recovering of sight to the blind to set at liberty them that are bruised to preach the acceptable year of the Lord and this is the undiluted holy word of the Lord and I say amen, amen and amen I heard in my spirit that some of God's remnants will be crossing Jordan but not alone some of God's remnants will be crossing Jordan in this year 2023, but not alone. God will send his holy angels to escort them. You heard me. Oh, some of God's remnants will be saying goodbye to us. They are crossing over to Jordan. They are going home to glory. Oh, glory to God, but they are not going alone because God is going to send his holy angels to escort them. Oh, God's veterans in his holy kingdom will manifest the latter portion of their callings before they cross Jordan. 
with escorted angels with them. Oh, I heard in my spirit that a saints that are going home to be with the Lord will experience a transitional hope. Oh, yes, and oh, unperishable hope of eternal life through Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Our God, see many of God's chosen people, souls around the altar of God. Oh, look at Revelation 6, verse 9. And when he had opened the fifth seal, I saw under the altar the souls of them that were slain for the word of God and for the testimony which they held. This is going to be a pivotal scripture and book in this year and beyond 2023. Revelation 6 verse 9. And I say amen, amen and amen to the powerful, powerful, powerful word of the Lord. I heard in my spirit that these four songs would become the saints, Holy Ghost, Heavenly Anthem. Oh, glory to God. Number one song, when the role is called up yonder by James Milton Black. Nine one song, when the role is called up yonder by James Milton Black. 1893. Number two song, when the saints go marching in by James Milton Black and Catherine Purvis. Number three songs, Peace, Wonderful Peace by Warren Cornell. And number four songs, Soon and Very Soon by Andre Roach and the disciples, 1976. Andre, in my spirit, that God's battalions will not leave planet Earth empty-handed. Significant will be their portion, and great shall be their rewards. I heard in my spirit that globally there will be much, 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 much disarray, divisions, and disconnections in palaces, governmental bodies, among leaders and leaderships. Yes, kingdom of God and in the kingdom of this earth. Hallelujah, secular and spiritual, physical and supernatural. I heard in my spirit, there will be much, 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 much disarray divisions and disconnections in the body of Christ also. See and read 1 Samuel 14 verse 16 and 1 Corinthians 14 verse 33. Also bank those two books in your spiritual bank accounts. March is the month and season of shaking all nations by God Almighty. All nations will be shaken by God Almighty. Go ahead and see and read Agai 2, verses 6 to 7, but also deposit the book of Agai in your spiritual bank account. I heard a spirit that God will shoot an, an arrow in the camp of his enemies and destroy hidden assignments that are unknown to humanity, but known to the only wise God, the omnipotent God. God is sending confusion in the camps of his enemy because God's enemy are his people's enemy. Yes, God is sending confusion, hallelujah, in the camps of his enemy because God's enemies are his people's enemies. Bless the Lord. Like the tower of Babel, our babe, God's capture the plans of the adversaries for his chosen saints. See and read Genesis 11 verses 6 through 8. Go ahead and bank the book of Genesis in your spiritual bank account. I heard in my spirit that there will be disarray in many workplaces or chaos after chaos. All workers and co-workers will turn on managements and 
managers, yes, CEOs, EDs, directors, hallelujah, leaderships in the workplaces, and those in top positions in companies. Watch out for the chaos after chaos in workplaces. Oh, yes, co workers will turn against co workers. Oh, God Almighty, co workers also will turn on managers, managements, oh, CEOs, presidents, oh, God Almighty, directors, EDs, and those in top positions in companies are disarray, disarray, dysfunctions will happen in workplaces globally. Oh, glory to God Almighty, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, you will protect your people. Oh, glory, glory, glory. I heard in my spirit that some of God's saints will get a good view of heaven. Oh, that we talk so much about and are waiting to be old. Yes, some of God's holy people will be able to steer straight into heaven and be able to prophesy with accuracy and precision descriptions seen. Yes, some of God's stalwart will experience St. John 1 verses 47 to 51 and Genesis 28 verses 10 through 22. I heard in my spirit that this is the season that the brood of vipers shall be manifested in the earth stronger than before. Yes, I heard in my spirit, oh glory to God, that this is a season that the brood of vipers, brood manifested in the earth stronger than before. They are coming out of every corner of this earth and manifest boldly and also unapologetically. Greater evil shall come from the veins of these brood of vipers. See, read Matthew 12 verse 34 and it declares, O generation of vipers, how can he being evil speak good things? For out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speak it. And this is the relevant, important word of the Lord. And I say amen, amen, and amen. Oh yes, it is indeed March 2023. It is the month to march on to victory fearlessly. It is the month of wow, 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 and wow. It is the month of dividends, 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 dividends. Oh, glory to God Almighty. It is the month of expansions. Oh, yes, times four. It is the month and season and year 2023. Oh, of great acceleration. Oh, glory to God Almighty, times four with great promotions, times four. Oh, fasting, oh God, double, double. Oh God Almighty, not just four, but eight. Oh God, fasting times eight. Oh, fasting, oh times 12. Oh, praying and praying. Oh, pray on, oh God's warriors, pray on intercessors pray on battalions oh pray on because this is the month of answered prayers oh pray on oh god has heard your cries oh yes and he will answer oh the cries of your heart and you will come to perfect that which concern it you oh solutions are appointed and are on its way to your door hallelujah solutions are at your door or oh, receive it in the name of Jesus, that which you have prayed for and has forgotten about. Solutions are coming in the mails. Oh, glory to God in your mailboxes. Oh, solutions via emails. Oh, glory to God. Solutions are coming in various forms. On your telephone, good news shall ring unto you. Good news our glory to God is packaged unto you. Good news will be delivered to you because this is the month of March. It is the month of the mouth and answered prayer. And this is the month that God has partnered with our mouth. Oh, our mouth, 
will partner with God's mouth and you know what's going to happen manifestations galore God bless you may you know and have hope that march on to victory because victory is assured unto us God's people and I say amen to these prophetic declarations worldwide the Lord bless thee, the Lord keep thee, the Lord make his face to shine upon thee and be gracious unto thee. The Lord lift up his countenance upon thee and bless thee with his peace. And I say world, shalom, shalom, shalom. Blessings everyone. My name is Reverend Dr. Seneth Brown, the founder and host pastor of the New Testament Church of Christ, the Redeemer of Canada, a place where dreams are realized and destinies are fulfilled. I am the last daughter of late Bishop Elijah Brown and late prophetess Estella Brown. It's with great privilege and honor to present and introduce to you my fifth book which is titled the holy spirit prophetic poetic reflection and they are right here this is the soft cover copy and this is the hard cover copy bless the lord i give god praise for these it is amazing life transforming edifying uplifting motivating and overcoming book just to give you an insight into my new book this book is my first autobiography and is an inspirational triumphant memoir about my life's eventful reflection with a few poetries I am coming from a very humble beginning. I faced enormous struggles, dreadful issues, distressing crises, horrible situations and circumstances, painful problems, dangerously adventurous moments, and not to mention being destitute. No season is wasted reaping God's double, seven times two equals 14, restoration this season. The Holy Spirit prophetic poetic reflection is now ready and available for purchase. You can purchase my book on Amazon, Google Play Books, Barnes and Noble, Chapters Indigo, Apple iBookstore, Freezen Press, bookstore and many 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 more platforms i declare to you today that your life is marked and designed to win and to be successful never give up hold on to the rope of hope find your rightful place in this world and leave a legacy before you exit thanks a bunch for purchasing my amazing, life-transforming, power-pack, redeeming book. A book that will change your perspective, change your outlook, change your life forever. Thank you. Once again, thanks a million for purchasing my awesome book in soft cover and hard cover. Thank you. The Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and bless you with his peace.